I know when a building's run properly, normally right when I walk into the main lobby. The way to tell is, is if a, a crew is doing their job correctly and the back of the house looks well put together. If it's clean, lights are on, the temperature is right, I mean, you get a really good idea right when you walk into a building. I've had the opportunity of actually going into, into the engineering rooms and you can tell that this is not something that they've cleaned up because uh, we are coming over. This is something that's been consistently maintained. We want to make sure that the engineers are on top of their game and not just taking care of the tenant calls from a day-to-day -day basis, but doing their building rounds, taking the meter readings and make changes as necessary to uh, make sure the building is running as most efficient as it can. They pretty much are the eyes and ears of my property, so it's not like I have to worry about everything because they're taking care of so much for me. So for instance, my chief engineer went through my parking structure and found ways that he could add LED lights that were going to have substantial savings to me and he even researched that there were rebates. So I mean, I feel like not only are they working for me, but they're also trying to help me save money at my property. When you come into a building and the engineer is running a certain way, and you give slight, small suggestions, and next thing you know, it starts snowballing. And the guy realizes that he's saving money, and it's easy. And the next thing, he's looking for another thing, and looking for another thing. And next thing you know, the managers are involved, and this thing starts growing to the point where everyone's just involved, and everything's coming together as a job. And at the end of the day, when they look at all the numbers and everything's all spread out, they realize, wow, that was easy. You know, they thought it was so difficult, but then it's simple, small steps that build up to a big thing. And I think saving that money and saving that energy for those folks are one of the neatest things in the world.